Hello, I am Harsha Tarla Pregda and you are watching Straight Up by edX Live. On December 11th, the Department of Community Medicine, Sabai Man Singh Medical College, Jaipur, issued a notice announcing the list of batch 2020 students eligible for the final NDBS Part 1 University exams scheduled to be held this month. Shockingly, only one student, Mayank Saini, from the batch 2020 was mentioned as eligible. Speaking to edX Live, a faculty member from the department disclosed that another student, Mohammad Abrar, who was detained due to an administrative error, has also qualified. As only two students were eligible out of a total of 250 NDBA students, the incident grabbed public attention. As mentioned in the notice, Saini is the only student who fulfilled the criteria laid down by the National Medical Commission and Rajasthan University of Health Sciences to appear for the final exams. Why was only one student eligible? It was noted that the main reason is attendance shortage. On anonymity, a faculty member of the department said that, as per the prerequisite, the students are required to attain 75% attendance in theory and 80% minimum attendance in practical as it is a professional course by nature. This is apart from the internal assessment requirements. However, despite issuing a warning in March 2023 and conducting extra classes, the students failed to make up for their attendance, said the faculty member. It may be noted that exams are scheduled to begin December 21st onwards. When we tried to understand what could be the underlying reason, the faculty member said the students are focusing more on preparing for the upcoming NEET PG exam. Therefore, they end up losing out on the MBBS training being provided in colleges. Low attendance certainly has its consequences and it is also a fact that students need to prepare for NEET PG. Why does this happen? What can be done to remedy the situation? An expert tells us. It's really sad to see only one student is eligible to appear for the final year MBBS examinations. In fact, this might happen infrequently in many states also because many students want to give much more importance to very highly competitive post-graduation entrance exam after MBBS like NEET PG. In fact, the students know very well that only MBBS degree, they, with the MBBS degree, they cannot survive in the health industry. They have to do post-graduation. And for post-graduation also, for many, especially many specialized like general medicine or radiology, there's a huge competition. So students realize they, they really have to do very well in post-graduation to get a, a, a government free seat in the government medical colleges. So definitely now the medical council makes sure that they should give sufficient time for the, the final year exam also. Also sufficient time gap between the final year exam and also need PG exam. Then only students can balance and prepare it well so that they can really have a very competitive edge in the final PG entrance exams. Stay tuned to edit slide. Do like, share and subscribe. Stay safe and mask up.